Hey everybody, Professor Klein back here in the Human Anatomy Lab at Ohio University to bring you a quick video on breast tissue. So this video is going to cover the anatomy of this breast tissue model as well as some clinical conditions that can occur, especially breast cancer. So let's begin with where are the breasts on the body? They're right on the thoracic cage, that rib cage right there. And if you look real close into here, you can see some of the ribs. Now the ribs are deeper than this red part, which would be the muscle. So this specifically would be the pectoralis major muscle, that, that chest muscle. Notice these green items though here. Those are lymph nodes, lymph nodes in this area as well. But as you start going from deep to superficial, you get a lot of yellow adipose tissue. All this yellow in here is the adipose tissue and that often determines the size of the breast tissue. But this pink part, the pink part are the breast lobules lobules here i'll throw up a picture of breast lobules in addition to this model because that's where the breast milk is actually produced in those pink lobules now you'll notice also traveling through all these weight ligaments we got these ligaments coming through to separate the lobules and hold the breast tissue together. Now everything's coming out to this part. And this part is coming together to what's called the sinus, the lactiferous sinus via the lactiferous ducts. So let me zoom in here for you and show you. The sinus would be this area and the ducts would be leading into that area. Now the tip is the nipple. So the nipple is where all those ducts come together. And the areola is this other colored part, pink around the nipple itself. Now in terms of what clinically is abnormal about this breast tissue, well, if we look and see we can see different types of cancer and cysts and actually a few different things. I'm going to label them on the video here. And if you want to Google and look more into these conditions, you can. But these are a lot of different types of cancer and cysts that occur in the breast tissue. All right. This has been your quick video on the breast tissue model. I'm Professor Klein. I'm coming to you from the Human Anatomy Lab at Ohio University. Thanks for watching.